Okay, buddy. So today, we'll be reacting to definitely what a lot of people would consider like a rap classic, especially from the early uh, 2000s, um, called Rubber Band Man by T.I. And this was before... I don't know what's up with the dude. He just went weird after a while. I don't know why, but a great rapper just, I don't know, he just went kind of downhill at some point. But anyways, um, actually pretty good rap career. Um, otherwise, so, yeah, so, they about acting to T.I.'s classic Road Band Man from his, I think, first or second album, pretty sure for, no, I think second, one of those trap, it, trap music, anyways, one of his first albums, trap music, so, here we go. Hey, you know you me. Yeah, they love, I really love, love the fact that there's definitely a certain sense of simplicity and there's not much craziness going on and you can follow the beat so yeah in this case they decided like go for like a organ kind of thing and then you know gotta get the it because that's what trap music kind of is basically um is that yes it's a form of edm technically but at the same time it is hip-hop so you know um so trap yeah in fact trap was a been land in georgia uh, this time, talk, I think T.I. practically invented or somebody, but yeah, so, yeah, good times. This is like the very beginning of trap music and not what it's now, which is most of our rap. I'm sure there's some ones that still do, like, a T.I. kind of style, but, um, it, is, it seems to be more of a rap, and I'm like, yeah, but anyways, again, I, I try to give them rapper shop, and I'm just like, uh, uh, just kind of annoys me sometimes i just don't know just anyways let's just get back to this be <laughs> staying down on the road i ain't rolling all the way from florida m.i.a i don't hey, know the duval hey, hey, i don't know the tennessee hey, a lot of the hey, real hey, niggas be showing hey, love you know what i'm saying i really appreciate hey, that hey, hey, all the double hey, boy hey, because i gotta get that big thump in there you know make a trap too so yep that boy something might happen yeah but i all the home girl be showing hey, love hey, but a lot of folk man they still be looking like they don't know who i'm here Man, wild is the Taliban. Nine in my right, forty-five in my other hand. I'm in trouble, man. I always in trouble, man. I work a couple hundred. Line of like, we're bam, wild that band, cause uh, it it just great. It, it's poetry, really. Man, it's all colors, man. I'm a rubber band, man, like a one-man band. Trees, niggas like the Apollo, and I'm the sand man. Told a hundred grand, cannon in the waistband, looking for. I believe. That's the guy's name, Sandman. Is that yeah? There's this character at the Apollo Theater, and what he does is his hat, his whole stick thing is that he has a big cane, um, thing, and then like when um, uh, when like a person fails on stage at the Apollo, what he does is he goes out and then like he hooks them back through the stairs, something like that. Or I'm sure there's everything something here, but I, I know that the Apollo. That's their big thing is that there's this guy, and then like he has a suit cane, and then he... Is that show even on anymore? Is that a BET thing? I only know about it because of Quad on AFN, so we don't really have like separate channels like you guys do in the US. We have like AFN Quadulin, um, AFRTS, which are kind of interchangeable really on Quad because it is a military base, so... So, and comment down below if that show is even still on, um, Men at the Apollo it's called, yeah. Um, a great show. In fact, there's this one Evelyn Lyra's guy who, um, who actually tried to make like a parody of "It's Good Not Here," and like people just weren't feeling it. Um, <laughs> yeah, so yeah, he just got dragged right to stage by the guy with the cans. Uh, good fun times, fun times. Well, this is the wrong place, man. Every time, better. And what I care about a case, man. I'm campaigning to bury the haze. Don't say you're great, hey, man. Hey, I don't behind a nigga back. I say it in his face. I'm a thoroughbred nigga. I don't fake it now. I don't hate. Check my resume, nigga. With my records and pepper. I'm anywhere in the A, nigga. I tell this high to respect. I am an MIA, nigga. I'm trying to keep it professional. Cause all this tall rats in the fan, I have it snapping. I'm telling you. From the bottom of the Duval. Pack a lack it in New York. And everybody showing me, Lord, that's when the you all Yeah, follow my Florida nigga, my Cackalaka nigga My Check LA niggas and my New York niggas New Orleans, hey, between. Hey, who I love me? Rubber band, man, wild as the Taliban Nine in my right, 45 in my other hey, hand I'm in trouble, man, I always in trouble, man I'm worth a couple hundred grand, cannon in the waistband Looking for a nigga that's been through the same thing Rubber band, man, wild as the Taliban Nine in my right, 45 in my other hand I'm in trouble, man, I always in trouble, man I'm worth a couple hundred grand, cannon in the 
rubber band man Wild as the Taliban Nine in my right, 45 in my other hey, hand I hey, got me trouble man, I always in trouble man I'm Worth a couple hundred grand, shit is all colors man I'm in trouble man, stay in some trouble man Some niggas still hate no shouters, but they some suckers man Got a couple fans that love to do nothing other than Mix up, show nuts it was just be sucker sometimes because, yeah, you know, it's kind of crazy because it's like, sure, a lot of these artists can't true enough, but it's like, also there's the fact, you know, the hater is also listening to the music as well, so it's just kind of an irony. It's like, if you're aiming that much, why are you even listening to my music? Why are you even even giving it a try? You know, because if you really hate the music, then you shouldn't really even give it a try, but if you give it a try, it means you're curious about it like enough that you're just like okay but and along with that mentality of it's like maybe try it first then hate on it but you know most a lot of people just like want to hate on it first before they ever get to know it but yeah again it's just this whole confusing thing of like yeah but you still listen to it though that's that's the thing and you're still giving me views um streaming whatever yeah so <laughs> all kind of irony, really. <laughs> hey, but still I love a man. Yeah. Did you look pimpin'? Got the mind and the muscle. Stay down on his grind. Put the crown on the heart. Hey, I can show you how to juggle anything and make it dull. We blow real estate, look a stone with no trouble. Your cash is play on my day and Marvin Gaye on my time. Trying to stay alive, living high, saying my rhyme. My cousin used to tell me take this shit a day at a time. He told me. So, not exactly Marvin Gaye because Marvin Gaye could actually sing but you know back then when this came out definitely T.I. was fucking everywhere so he actually had a point there that yeah Marvin Gaye was time he's he's right within like the hip-hop circle at this given time where seven rappers were just getting insanely huge Luda, T.I., Young Jeezy like whoop man it was it was it was insane man they were just everywhere just everywhere <laughs> it was it was also great at the same time because introduced people. It's like, yep, we Southerners, we we have rap too. We we have David Banner, we got Ti, we got Young Jeezy, we got some talent down here. So yeah, might as well show it off. Yeah. Up for my cousin, too. Rest in peace, y'all. Left by Jam Mouse and Jay. Now, who I mean? Rubber band man, wild as the Taliban. Nine in my right, 45 in my other hand. Hey, who I mean? I'm in trouble, man. I always in trouble, man. I'm worth a couple hundred grand. Hey, Shit is all colors, man. Hey, who I mean? Rubber band man, wild as the Taliban. Nine in my right, 45. Still the background crowd, and quite like, nah, nah. It's, it's great. Uh, I know that there is like a lot of artists like doing that. A lot of rap artists during this time doing that of like having like a kid back in choir because you know it's a weird one because that's what rap and a lot of music is, is that they want to get as a shout to as much people you know so that's why rap would definitely be considered like street gospel really in a sense what you think about it because they want to spread a message you know and you know and speak their peace and stuff so yeah but i guess when that's what rap has always been but a lot of people Especially in like in 80s and 90s, like, didn't understand that. And they were just like, you're like the Green Bird and stuff. It's like, no. A lot of times they're just like saying what they see and like their hood or we're not. And sometimes what happens in the hood is it's, it's just nuts, really. So, you know, that's what some people can't comprehend is that, you know, they kick up in like what's outside. They're like bubbles sometimes. So it's like they just want to hate on it. And that's the, the way rap. A lot of times, or pretty much all the time, has been, you know, just people just can't, you know, fathom what's outside their own understanding that they just want to hate on it instead of just giving it a try first, you know, because that's what's happened a lot of times, you know, even like even him said, like his, a lot of his rap is just stress relief, really. That's what he's said a lot, so. You know, and I, I dig it that if it's stress relief, you know, because sometimes you just gotta just speak it out, you know. So yeah, that's just a rapper, pretty much. <laughs> <laughs>
my bill. I'm in trouble, man. I always in trouble, man. I'm worth a couple hundred grand. Shannon's all covers, man. I'm in grand hustle, man. More hustles than hustle, man. But why the rubber band? They representing the struggle, man. And my folk who try until they come up with another plan. Stack a couple grand to get they stuff off their mama land. Gangsters who been serving since you was doing the running, man. Went down, did 10, back round, and rich again. That's why I'm young with the soul of an old man. Shell shot, get shot, slow your roll, man. And still ride around with the Glock on patrol, man. Nah, I ain't robbing, I'm just looking for the troll, man. For my niggas slaying blow, whipping hoes, rolling bowl, 24. Let these other niggas know who I am mean. Rubber band, man, wild is the Taliban. Nine in my right, 45 in my other hand. I'm in trouble, man, I always in trouble, man. I'm worth a couple hundred grand, chances all colors, man. Who I mean? Rubber band, man, wild is the Hey man, watch my bone while I go to the store. Shit, nigga. Watch your ass, nigga. You don't know, motherfucking watch me. <laughs> oh shit, man, I done came See that man told you, watch your bone. Look at that nigga over there. Oh shit. Man, that stupid ass nigga had a stove somewhere, Pablo. Fucking with a hole or something. Fuck this nigga. Gotta go. Hey, I got some time. Not being on top of your shit. $500. A bag of Joe in the same cuff spot. $125. Ass whooping, priceless. God damn, man. What? Man, hell nah, man. What the fuck going on? I thought I told you niggas to watch my bomb and shit. What's up? <laughs> shit, man. Nigga, I ain't responsible for that motherfucking shit, nigga. I but I, you did, though. I did see Conway over there. Oh, man. Hell nah. I'm whipping Conway motherfucking ass. Don't do shit, Bust his shit, man. Let's do it. Well, let's do it. She was watching shit, though, nigga. Damn, man. In today's black market, a sucker needs some type of security. We at Buster Carter found that solution. Are you tired of getting tried like a freak at a cut party? Maybe it's time you tried Buster Carter for all of life's little trap problems. Call toll free at Number the FDIC. Some lanes are subject to credit approval. Man, my credit ain't no good in the hood. I don't know if I can get that shit. Buster Card. <laughs> <laughs> that was just that was just great, especially at the end with the skits. I love the skits of the rap albums. They're just amazing and hilarious a lot of the time. Just great. Sometimes they're like deep, but you know, a lot of times they're just hilarious, especially with the Buster Card things. <laughs> fun times, fun times. But anyways, yeah, this is great track from awesome hip hop artists, and yeah, so uh, good times. Ti. Or Bandman, yeah. See you later. Bye.